with the good news first. How's that? So okay. next week, LA County will receive it is its largest vaccination shipment yet. This is about 340,000 doses, which is a 20% increase over this week. Still, LA County public health officials say when the eligibility pool opens to residents 50 and older next Thursday, that's about another million people and they don't expect to have enough doses to handle the influx. I want to uh, make sure the public recognizes that there may be challenges to getting an appointment immediately. Uh, it just again reflects the limited supply of vaccine, even with an increased supply of vaccine. We certainly can't handle, you know, close to a million people uh, over that first week. Dr. Paul Simon, he is the chief science officer with LA County Public Health. He says residents need to be patient, especially as priority will continue to be given to the hardest hit communities. In fact, 65% of next week's shipment will be directed to areas like South and East LA, the Antelope Valley, San Gabriel Valley, where residents are most vulnerable. All right, then on April the 15th, as we have reported, the eligibility pool widens to include everyone 16 and older. Health Director Barbara Ferrer, she was on Good Day LA this morning. She talked about those supply constraints, but she also talked about her concerns about spring break and numbers rising in other parts of the country. She says that the country is seeing outbreaks with students returning from Mexico, students returning from Florida. She says that LA County cannot afford to do that. So she's encouraging people not to celebrate the upcoming I mean, spring holidays as we normally might. So think smaller celebrations and just be smart about it. Now, the other big question is about appointments. Can you make your appointment in advance? It all depends. Right now, uh, myturn.ca.gov, the universal website, you have to be within the eligibility pool to make your appointment.